And what we'll do is look at just placing a standard door, maybe a double door in this front wall. So to do that, we go to the door tool. And again, we have Academy's library, grab the door. This time I'm gonna go straight to parametric blade design. And we have one unit that's 810 wide. We'll just double that up. So we now have a double door. Again, we have controls for the shape. So we could actually go and add cuts. We could add curves. We can add whatever is required to the overall shape here. So let's see, 450. So we now have just an arch topped doorway. But what we'll do with it in this case, I'm just gonna add a 150 shoulder on either side. And what I'll do is go back to the side lights and over lights. And if we just add 450 in here, what that gives us is a break. So we have a little sectioned off fan light above our double door here, which uh, looks truly stunning. Moving on, I'm gonna skip through some of the settings, but what I'm gonna do is go to the door leaf itself. I'm gonna choose something a little bit more interesting. We'll scroll to the bottom. You see there's also an option for custom panel. We can go and grab that as well. In terms of the panel inserts, we can make them glass. We can actually make them frame glass. There's other options where we can have bevels, we can have tongue and groove, louvers, etc. I'm quite happy to keep it symmetrical. Again, we have other options you've seen previously where we can go and choose handles and kick plates and set the properties for the frames, etc. But I'll just go with that as it is. Only thing I'll do is I'll give this a reveal 100mm to the wall face and 0mm to the story. So we simply hit OK, come in here, give that a click, and then choose to open inwards or outwards. So again, if we look at 3D, we can now see a tremendous door in our opening here.